YouTube. Welcome back, you guys. I told you guys I was gonna be more consistent with these videos with YouTube, so here I am once again. And before we get into the video, you guys already know, Mamba Gang, Mamba Army, Laker fans, Kobe fans, basketball fans, and just everyone around the world. Thank you guys once again for coming back to my channel. If it's your first time here, please subscribe to my channel. I'm here to kind of give you guys uh, Kobe content, Kobe related content, shoe content, and just to spread the Mamba mentality aspect uh, throughout life. Um, so yeah, uh, happy Sunday to everyone out there. Happy weekend. Uh, today is Sunday. I think we're about a week away from Easter, if I'm not mistaken. So I do want to wish everyone out there a very, I guess, um, happy weekend, you know? I uh, hope everyone out there is staying strong, staying sane. It has been a crazy two, three last few years for everyone, really challenging. But as usual, man, stay with that mama mentality. Uh, that's one thing that I've always preached. Kobe always preached to be the best version of yourselves. So find that version and just bring it out. You know, I believe we're all capable of achieving anything that we want in life. We all have that that Kobe in us, that Mamba mentality. And sometimes we're afraid because of fear. We're afraid to take risk. We're afraid to get out of our comfort zone. So, you know, we stay stuck in the same place uh, for a long time, which is probably, you know, the worst thing you can do because if you want more out of yourself, more out of life, you gotta try new things. You gotta get out of your comfort zone. You gotta learn. Um, so yeah, with that being said, you guys, today I do have a video, a uh, quick, actual video of a uh, review for uh, the hoodie that re was released with the Mamba Cita Sports Academy and the Mamba, Mamba Cita Sports Academy and Vanessa and I believe it's a champion hoodie if I'm not mistaken. I have not opened the package so it's going to be a first look for me and you guys. I want to give you guys my thoughts on it. I believe from what I've hearing a lot of people are kind of iffy about it because the price of this hoodie was not cheap in a sense especially for being a, a champion hoodie i believe the price point was around over 100 bucks i know for sure i don't remember the exact price but it released about a month ago and i'm barely opening up the package today um so yeah let's get into it man right, you guys so i did show you uh the packaging that it came in on my last video so here it is i just cut it open it obviously does come i guess with the invoice receipt right there Okay, looks nice. Looks like it came with some some small goodies inside. All right, so it did come with this little card. Let's see what it says. So it is the Mamba, Mamba Cita Sports Foundation. Thank you for supporting the foundation and for furthering Kobe and Gigi's legacy. Care instructions due to the special screen printing. Do not machine dry with heat. Machine wash cold inside out on delicate cycle. Hang air dry only. A special gift we've also included. A red bracelet, it is engraved with 5106, Gigi's birthday. We encourage you to wear your MMSF gear on social. Please tag Mamba C Mamba, Mamba C the Sports. Hashtag play Gigi's way. So there you have that. Let me get this open so we can actually take a look at this hoodie. Kind of hard doing this with one hand, but it's all good. Okay, so first off, what I see here is right here on the drawstrings, we have this little rubber bracelet, kind of like the ones that, you know, a lot of people do wear, the Nike ones and stuff like that. So it does say, okay, so it says Gigi Bryant, Hart, Mamba Sita 5106, which it explained on there that that was her, uh, Gigi's birthday. Hashtag play Gigi's way. So there you have it, you guys. Boom. Pretty cool, pretty cool. Okay, so now let's take a look at the hoodie itself. First off, I can feel it's it's an actually not bad hoodie as far as um, material. It feels like it does have some weight to it. I'm used to feeling like champion hoodies, mostly really lightweight and really soft. This has more of a rugged uh, feeling to it. So let's see if I can get some lighting to it. So you guys see that? 
and obviously you're not gonna be able to tell or feel it off this video but it does have some weight to it I want to say so um, I do I did get a large I got this in a large that's actually I get all my hoodies in a large for mostly everything Nike and everything so I did go with the large so there you have it champion it says reverse weave maybe that's I guess the material large so boom okay so let's spread this out and let me move a couple things here so we can all take a look at it and see exactly what's what on the actual hoodie okay so it does have that mamba Cita sports academy logo right in the middle it's not too big not too small i think it's perfect it's right above this little pocket pouch that well you know most hoodies do have okay now the drawstrings right here on the hoodie are pretty 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 nice i mean i don't know exactly what i mean by that but yeah so on the hoodie itself it does have the number two the number eight and the 24 if you guys uh did see i think i believe Trey Young was wearing this hoodie on one of the after the game um, what do you call it interviews or whatnot and he was wearing this hoodie so on the right sleeve it does have 2824 once again let's check the other sleeve this one just has that champion you know patch right there and I mean it's pretty basic let me see if I can zoom out or something here so that's what it is like I mentioned the hoodie on there or the hood on that and on the right side panel right here it does have the Mamba Mamba Cita Sports Foundation with the Mamba Cita Sports Academy thing uh, logo right there so I can't remember if they released any other colors but I did go with the black here if there was a different color. I just can't remember. I know there wasn't a lot of stuff released on this. I don't even remember if there was shirts. Yeah, you know what? I do believe there was shirts as well. So, But I did go with the hoodie. I might be wrong though because if you guys do remember, I think last year Vanessa did release that tie-dye uh, white sweater. Where I think I believe it was like white with like purple and stuff like that. I did not end up going for that one. I was just not very, I honestly was just not very happy with the price point on it. And second, tie dye colors and stuff like that. I mean, it's a 50-50 with those. I don't really wear that type of color uh, scheme and stuff like that. So yeah, so there you have it, you guys. I am gonna try it on. Now, I don't know, you know what? I didn't show you guys what's on this tag actually. But in this tag, it really just has that. And on the back side, it has that and Mamba Cita trademark or trademarks of Kobe Bryant LLC. So there you have it, you guys. Pretty basic. Um, I have a feeling because of the material that I'm feeling. You know what? I did not mention, but this side panel, I don't know if you guys can tell, is different from the rest of the hoodie. So it does have some different type of, I guess, uh, material right there on both little side uh, side sections right here. Sorry, I can't really catch this one on camera, but you guys know what I'm talking about since I showed you the other one. But there you go, man. I know for sure that, I don't know. Let me show you guys what I did cop when the Mamba Sita was having stuff or some of my Kobe stuff but you guys remember having these these were also on the Mama Cita Sports Academy website maybe like I believe before Kobe's passing and these are some that I ended up uh, copying I do have a video on some of that stuff check uh, my other uh, my video on that I'll probably link it at the end of this video if you guys are interested checking out checking that out but yeah that's pretty it man um nothing crazy i'm gonna try this on show you guys how it looks on me 
and in case you guys are interested in copying it like i said it did sell out so there's not available anymore on their website but i believe if you go on ebay and stuff like that you should be able to find one but then again it obviously will be probably over retail pricing because of um it's selling out so actually let me check how much the price was I'm not gonna show you guys the invoice because it has all my information, but you know what? It actually does not say the price. It just says that. Yeah. Let me see if, yeah, it doesn't say the price, you guys. So um, there you have it, man. Let me try this on and we'll finish off the video. All right, you guys, hopefully you can see it. I'm gonna back away in just a bit. I just wanna give you guys a little bit of a closer look on how I guess the upper above the waist looks on me maybe you can catch more of the details since I'm this much closer but it does have the Mamacita Academy logo there boom it actually um, let me back up here a little bit it has somewhat of a I don't want to say too loose feeling uh, I mean I, I'm actually not wearing a very thick shirt under but it fits okay right now. The only problem I do see with this type of material is that once you do wash it and you dry it, I believe what that note was really referring to is that you shouldn't air, uh, machine dry it because it will shrink. I can just tell already by the material that it is a heavy material, but it will shrink. So if you guys are looking to purchase this, I do suggest that if you want to bag your fit, go size bigger one size bigger than your normal regular uh size but i like it i like the fit the way it looks on me right now so i'm just going to be really careful that you know make sure i take care of it well don't get it too dirty and if i do need to wash it at some point to kind of air dry it you know hang dry it so that i don't have that shrinkage problem but yeah let's see uh but that's how it looks this is the how that sleeve looks at the end. And uh, let me see if I can give you guys a better angle. So, there you have it. It's pretty cool. Boom. Pretty sweet. I mean, I know winter is kind of over already, but this would be a perfect winter type of sweater hoodie that you can just throw on, you know, and represent obviously the Mamba, Mamba Cita Sports Academy, and obviously represent and keep the Kobe legacy going. So there you have it, you guys. Just wanted to give you guys a quick little look if you guys are interested or wanting to know how it looks, sizing wise or anything like that. But cool. So um, I'll close out the video now. I do have some more content for you guys coming up this week and it would be shoe related. I wanna, shoot, I wanna show you guys kind of, catch you guys up with some of the shoes that I have copped within the last couple of months. As you guys already know, I've been gone, but I do have some Kobe's that I've copped and I wanna give you guys some reviews and some looks on those. So yeah, that's it for today. Like I mentioned, please stay safe out there. Enjoy this weekend and I'll see you guys in the next video. Peace.